We are sending a cop to college. It's the Wilmywood Dinner with the Stars here in beautiful Kefir Community College's Union Station building. Absolutely gorgeous. And here with me, I made him go first because he's one of our favorite local actors. Peter Jurisic is join the clan. Good morning or good afternoon, I should say. Hi, Sheila. How are you? I'm so good. Thank you for coming. Oh, it's so great to be here. This is such a good cause and there's so many great people supporting it. So, yeah, of course. Couldn't miss it. Couldn't well, miss it. You have been an actor in just about every movie that's ever been made and every television series. Of course, <laughs> Babylon 5, you still get fan mail from. The last time we saw you on screen was in 42. So what have you been up to? Well, this semester I've committed to teaching over at the university. So the University of Wilmington, uh, North Carolina, Wilmington, and um, just finished my last class this week. Finals on Monday. So be ready, students. <laughs> Finals on Monday. And I did a, a small student film last weekend. A group of my students um, were putting together a project that needed, if it was going to be a SAG film, they needed a SAG actor, so I did it for them. Uh, then, you know, that, that's Peter, because that's what he does. He is all about helping actors and filmmakers get to the next level here in Wilmington, and we can't thank you enough for doing thank that. Thank you so much. Sheila. So what drew you here to send a cop to college? Well, there's one particular, I mean, I want to support the police department. There's one particular, Warren Kennedy, and he doesn't have, uh, you know, red lights that, and, and a siren on his phone, but he should, because he'll call you up and pull you over <laughs> and make you come, and that's what he did to all the celebrities. Awesome. He, call, he called me, and Warren just, you know, he's, he, yeah. he won't stop, and I'm so glad to be here. Yeah, that's the <laughs> same exact reason I'm here. That's okay. Warren Kennedy <laughs> and the police department. Thanks for coming tonight. Thank you, Sheila. And as we continue to go down the red carpet right here, we have our friend Vaughn Wilson. He is here, an awesome local, I call him a local actor, well, obviously because he lives here, but he doesn't appear that way on screen. Very popular in One Tree Hill, and he's done a lot of, uh, a lot of great acting roles since then. Thanks for coming, Vaughn. Oh, thank them for having us, man. It's been a wonderful time, and can't wait to look forward to it. It's enjoyable. So what's been going on with you? I know you had a couple of since. I, we've seen you on Eastbound and Down. What other projects have we seen you in the last year? Uh, the Planner's Peanut commercial. Oh, for one. yes, I, yes. I totally remember that. You, you're so great in that. <laughs> Thank you so much. So what's next for you? Uh, whatever comes along. Right? Whatever good project I can latch on to, I'm on it. You're on it, <laughs> right? So what made you come here tonight? Why do you want to send a cop to college? I mean, it, they do a tremendous job for the community and for everybody involved and just for the whole city of Wilmington, state of North Carolina and the country, actually. You know, yeah. They're all over. So anytime I can come out and, you know, just show some support to them, they got it anytime. Vaughn Wilson, y'all, thanks for coming tonight. Thank you for having me again. You're so sweet. Come here. And our fabulous celebrities are continuing to move their way in. And we have another local favorite, and that is Jane McNeil. And she is here. Many people know you as Patricia in The Walking Dead, but you have really expanded, and you've done a lot more since then. What's been going on with you? Uh, recently, I worked on a movie in New Orleans called Mississippi Grind that stars Ryan Reynolds and Ben Mendelsohn. Um, it's one big scene at the very beginning of the movie. I had to learn how to play um, Texas Hold'em. How'd that go? Or did you end up beating them by the end of the day? No. <laughs> no, I ended up having to have some um, prodding from the dealer <laughs> and some of the, and the, the pro that was right. there. He's like, oh, <laughs> um, but I think I, I think I acted it okay. Um, right. And then I worked on Rectify, a series on Sundance yeah. uh, films in Griffin, Georgia, actually about 15 minutes from where they film Walking Dead. Yeah, excellent. Um, so uh, that's that's the latest stuff. Yeah, and you were in Prisoners as well. Yeah, that, I got to be in a scene with um, Hugh Jackman and Viola Davis. Oh, the poor baby. Oh, having to do a scene with Hugh Jackman. It, he was super nice. I can imagine. And Viola Davis is, is my hero. Really? So just getting to spend a few hours just talking her, talking girl talk with right. her it was amazing. It was really cool. So you're here tonight for a very special cause, not just to be a celebrity. You are here because you are supporting, of course, the Wilmington Police Department. Yes. So that's my question. Why do you want to send a cop to college? Well, I think it's a really important opportunity for everybody, no matter what your field, yeah. to continue your education. And, um, you know, to be able to advance and have more knowledge. And uh, one of the men I was speaking to, ended up going on into teaching himself, you know, right. teaching um, other policemen, so. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, I think that's a great opportunity. That's amazing. Jane is here, and she will be here all evening, and we are glad to have her. Thanks for coming. Thank you so much.
Are you coming to the film? Room? More celebs join the red carpet as we send a cop to college, a big Wilmy Wood dinner with the stars. And with me right now is the wonderful, delightful, always making me laugh, Sydney Penny. Hello. I you were making me laugh. No. <laughs> okay. She's my doppelganger. That's what it is. Totally. That's right. So, of course, we know you from since childhood. You've been on TV. You can't escape it. No, I can't escape anything. <laughs> since IMDb came around, that's it. I'm wide open. <laughs> well, last summer she was here. She shot The Perfect Summer, which is such a great family film with Eric Roberts. And now you're, it seems like you're like just committing yourself to every nonprofit <laughs> in Wilmington. Yes, it does seem that way. But I'm so thrilled to be able to help. So we're sending a cop to college tonight. And that's um, such a, a fabulous thing to be a part of. I'm, I'm really thrilled with this whole idea, this whole organization, that young people at the beginning of their careers are going to have the opportunity to get the skills that will carry them further in their careers, get them the pay that they deserve, the promotions that they deserve, and then to be able to pass that knowledge on to other young cops at the beginning of their careers. So I think it's just a terrific thing now for you, all of us. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And you were talking about education, education in the arts as well you're involved in. I am. I am involved. Shocker. <laughs> with Theater Network of Wilmington. And we have a theater arts outreach called Superstar Academy. And uh, we have a wonderful facility out of Theater Now, which is at 10th and Dock. Fabulous, fabulous facility. And we are offering theater arts education to some of our local schools that unfortunately have had to cut their programs because of budget. So we go in and we, uh, we teach them about the theater, how to act, how to do improv. And, and the nice thing about it is it's really skills that kids can take away so much about how to deal with just life. It's not about becoming a performer. It's about learning to express yourself, to have self-confidence and poise, and to be comfortable interacting with others. And uh, I'm just thrilled to be a part of it. I leave it to Sydney Penny to be a part of that too. Fabulous. Thanks for coming tonight. Thank you for coming. I hope you have fun. <laughs> Continuing to talk to the stars as we send a cop to college. Model extraordinaire and actor is sending to Cup to College. This is Justin Barnhill. Thank you so much for coming tonight. It's my pleasure to be here and thanks for inviting me. Let me tell you, The Perfect Summer, you are just downright adorable, but since last summer in The Perfect Summer, which was on the Up Network and aired, you have done a ton of work in the acting world as well as the modeling world. Yeah, I gotta say, the, uh, the acting world threw me for a little loop and I loved it. So uh, the modeling world's been good. Uh, we just did Tommy Hilfiger, you can uh, see that. Uh, I don't know if we have any Tommies around Wilmington. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna hunt it down you know, and find I it. I need to call Tommy. We need to have Tommy Hilfiger here <laughs> because this is where it started in Wilmy Wood. That's right. Yes, ma'am. Well, you had some fun on Banshee, I heard. Banshee was amazing. Uh, you know, I just got stepped up to a recurring role, so I'm happy about that. And uh, no one take my character too seriously. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you know, I was bullying people a little bit on uh, the Perfect Summer. Yeah. But uh, you know. It, it was it's very well, and uh, I'm working on some more movie things now. Um, we got some new management, so I'm happy happy for the future. Well, you got to tell me. Speaking of future, you're sending a cop to college, and uh, apparently your mom is a lifelong friend of a friend of mine, Warren Kennedy. So you guys are here together. Your mother is adorable, by the way. You are very fantastic. <laughs> yeah, Warren is a very nice man. I just had the pleasure of meeting him myself, and uh, I look forward to meeting the whole the whole unit. So what's the what's the What's, why is it so important to you to send a cop to college? I, I like to protect the people and help the people who protect the future of where we're at right now. These people protect me while I sleep. I will support them to the, my dying day. Simple as that. Well, thanks for coming in and enjoy tonight. Thank you so much. I'm glad to be here.